Hi, I'm Wiley. And you're watching Cat TV News. Uh, all right, hope y'all enjoyed our long weekend, even though that means our news will be a little bit short this week. Um, agriculture's Valentine's Day rose sale was a hit, raising a ton of money for agriculture. We're all looking forward to their next fundraising sale. Senior Cat TV reporters interviewed our very own Mr. Patterson about his esports team. Let's see what he had to say. Hi, I'm Stella from Cat TV News, and I'm here with our esports Overwatch team and their coach, Mr. Patterson, to talk about their success this season. So, Mr. Patterson, what is the role of a coach in esports? So being a coach in esports is much just like being a coach in any regular sport. I facilitate practice, I make sure everybody is doing their job, and everybody is getting better so that when we play competitively, we are doing our best. What is your favorite part about esports? So uh, I love esports in total. I think it's a great way for everybody to be getting involved. And my favorite part is that people that aren't normally involved in school activities definitely want to be involved in esports, and that gets everybody into the school activities. How do you describe the game that you play? Uh, the game that we play is a very team-based game. It basically involves six players, uh, three different roles, and we go up against other teams, other high schools, and we basically either have to defend a point, move a point, or capture a point on the map that we are playing. Uh, what is your win slash loss record in the Cape Atlantic League so far? Our uh, win loss would be 7-0. and and what teams are you playing against? Um, some of the more well-known teams that we played against are ACIT, Middle Township High School, saying that they're right next door, um, Absagami, and Oak Crest. Uh, what is your favorite part about esports? My uh, favorite part about esports is there isn't really a limit. It could be anything you want it to be. So it can any game you play, it could be in esports, and it, it can just bring a lot of people together and like kind of like make a family. Um, what interested you about esports? Um, uh, I always liked playing video games since I was a kid, and it just felt like, you know, it would be nice to play competitively with the friends that I know, and it felt like it brought us all together as a team, and just in this school was really nice because some of us don't have all the time in the world after school. So to be able to, you know, tell our parents it's a school-based program and all of that. And then we all just come together and have fun. And uh, do you plan to play competitively after high school? Uh, I'm going to try to play competitively at Stockton University, but not 100% sure. And you, Kevin? Uh, I'm going to try to play competitively. I'm not sure for who yet, but I am looking to after now. We also do have a summer season this year, so I do plan on playing after this year. I'm dead. I'm dead. It's got detail. I'm dead. I don't know how I'm not dead. I'm dead. Bubble, you can get some bubble. Can't see you. Oh. Eva's live, don't wake her. If I can get Kevin to stay on point. I'm gonna die. They're, they're, they're the trying to focus me. I stayed alive so long. I can't get the edge right there. Mm, we're so close. But we, we can win this game. <sighs> How would you describe the game that you play? Overwatch is a 6v6 team-based strategy game with three separate divided roles. Uh, what are the different roles in the game? There are damage, support, and tanks. What is your favorite part about esports? My favorite part is just making plays during our competitive games. Because like, sometimes you have a chance of getting the replay at the end of the game. And it makes you feel very great about yourself. What interests do you in esports? Uh, just video games in general. I just like playing video games. Do you plan to play competitively after high school? I personally don't. I know some other people on the team do. Uh, yeah, the Marines actually have an esports team, so I could probably do that for a while. Yeah, I think I will do. How do you describe the game that you play? Overwatch is a team-based strategy game that is centered around capturing and defending objectives. What is your win-slash-loss record in the Cape Atlantic League so far? 
This year, we have a 7 to 0 win loss ratio, and last year in a National League H HSEL, we play 16 out of a uh, 230 or 50 teams. What teams are you playing against? Uh, we're versing a lot of the teams that even the other competitive sports in the school verse, such as Middle, Oak Crest, and Cedar Creek. Uh, what is your favorite part about esports? Um, I like uh, like playing games with my friends and getting to play competitively for the school. I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, what interested you in esports? Um, well, I always liked playing video games and. As a competitive person, getting to play for the school, I thought that would be a lot of fun, and it is. Uh, do you plan to play competitively after high school? If so, where? Uh, I plan on playing collegiately, uh, still deciding on what college, but wherever I go, I aim to play there for scholarship. Um, I'm going to play esports definitely uh, for college uh, at Stockton. Thank you so much to our esports team and Mr. Patterson. Back to you guys in the studio. Uh, the FFA is having a dress up week this week. Today was camo day, tomorrow will be golden blue day, and Thursday will be future occupation slash CTE day. And Friday we'll finish it off with our country versus country club day. You can dress as if you're going to a country club or a rodeo. Let's see which one wins. Our question of the week was about everyone's favorite Girl Scout cookies, which are currently in season. Okay, so mine is Thin Mints. I don't care what anybody says, Thin Mints are the best Girl Scout cookie you can ever have. Uh, my favorite Girl Scout cookies are Thin Mints. I agree with Matt. My favorite Girl Scout cookies are also mint. Uh, peanut butter. My favorite Girl Scout cookie is whatever somebody buys for me. I gotta say the lemonades are the best. Um, I don't know, the coconut ones? What's your favorite Girl Scout cookie? Well, that would be very easy to answer. Uh, the Thin Mint, as probably is mostly everyone else's favorite Girl Scout cookie. But it's just a classic that you can never go wrong with. Um, Thin Mints. I like shortbread. I like Thin Mints. Oh, the peanut butter one. <laughs> the peanut butter. <laughs> uh, what's, your, what's your favorite cookie, Marlo? I know you're a Girl Scout in your troop. You know, I've been trying to figure out what's so different about you, and I think I think I've finally figured it out. You got a new haircut, didn't you? Oh my God! How did you know? <laughs> of course I know. I'm your bestie. Anyway, I'm Wiley, and I'm Marlo, and you're watching Cat, Cat TV, TV News. News. 